Hey, what is up everybody? I hope you all are having a great day and a great start to your week. And Happy New Year everybody. I hope you all had a great New Year celebration and I hope you all are having a great start to your New Year's. So every year I talk about New Year's resolutions. Like what is your New Year's resolution? What is your goal that you want to set for yourself? And oftentimes, a lot of people tend to give up their, on their goal um, fairly quickly. And if that's you, no problem. Remember, this is a new year. It's a chance for new beginnings. It's another chance to uh, set your start your year the right way. Start your year out great. So, if you are the one who tends to give up on your New Year's resolution or give up on your New Year's goal pretty quickly. It's good to ask yourself, like, why do you give up on it so quickly? Is it like an unrealistic goal? Maybe you're not even that passionate about that goal right now. Whatever it happens to be, um, if, if it's a goal that you're not passionate about, simply just don't really set that goal. Set a different goal or, or maybe set a more obtainable goal that you believe that you can accomplish. And once you have that goal, I think it's good to write it down. I think it's good to break it down step by step on how you're going to achieve that goal. And once you, you break it down, write out your daily tasks. And I also think it's good to put that goal in front of you every single day. And when you put that goal in front of you, because sometimes when we set a goal, we're excited for it, we go to sleep, and the next morning we're kind of forget about that goal. It's easy to forget about that goal. And sometimes that happens to us when we're setting our new resolutions. We set it, we're excited about it, and we tend to maybe forget about it one day and then eventually forget about it altogether. But when you write it down and put it in front of you, I don't know, maybe put it somewhere around your house, maybe put it, um, maybe write it down every single day, maybe have like a note card and just write down your goals that you want to achieve this year and look at it multiple times a day. Uh, find a method for yourself where you're going to continue to look at your goal and continue to put your goal right in front of you so it can help, help you remember it and help you get excited about it. And then, as I, as I was saying before, write down action steps to help you achieve it every single day. Write down goals. Maybe when you end the, end the day, uh, write down your goals for the next day. Next day, um, Jim Rohn always says, uh, st "Start the day before you finish. Uh, finish the day before you start." In other words, write down your goal, uh, write down your action plan, plan it, and then really see yourself completing that, completing your day before you officially start it. So complete it in your head, complete it on paper before you start it. So then you are already prepared for the next day. You know what to do. You aren't wasting any time. And it can help you keep yourself accountable to what your goal happens to be. And it can be anything. It could be a career goal. It could be a health goal. It could be a weight loss goal. It could be learning a new language or learning something, <laughs> whatever it happens to be. But main thing is just to write that down your goals when it's day so you're not forgetting about it. Sometimes when we tend to go to sleep, we tend to forget about it, and then eventually we'll, we forget about it altogether. So do something to keep that goal right in front of you at all times, and that makes you look at it and remember it and get yourself excited about it on a daily basis. Because Zig Ziglar House has had this great quote where he says, um, motivation doesn't last. But neither does bathing. That's why we, we recommend it daily. Make sense? So yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you got all guys got something on this video. And I hope you all have a great new year. Have a great week. And I'll talk to you all later. If you ever want to talk to me about goals, business, or personal development, or anything like that, uh, please let me know. Message me. Feel free to hit me, hit me up. And I'll talk to you all later. Okay, bye everybody.